guys it's Clara welcome back to my channel this video is a big grocery haul in addition to the meal plan for the week it's a bigger haul for us just because we're hosting a couple different of small parties stay tuned So as I said, we're hosting a couple different parties. One is a game night, and the theme is French breakfast. The second thing that we're hosting is a mom's group, kind of a brunch luncheon kind of thing. So first thing I bought were four pounds of strawberries, a couple different uh, broccoli crowns. I'm going to be making some quiches, some celery, some unsweetened iced tea, pink lemonade, raspberry lemonade, red skin potatoes, onions, which we'll use pretty much every day, some cashews, an assortment of tomatoes. I love these tomatoes, yummy. Some kale, I'm gonna make some kale quinoa salad, a baguette, French loaf here, and then a couple things of smoked salmon. One is the pastrami wild Alaskan sockeye, and another is this smoked Atlantic salmon, oat cord smoked. The quinoa again. But they had a coupon for this, which is so nice to find because these are not the cheapest kinds of meats. It's the Applegate Naturals uncured honey ham. And then I bought some Italian wedding cookies, but we kind of dug into them already. So there's only like nine left in there. I think there was a dozen. And I am going to try to do a cheater recipe for Queen Amman. And if you don't know what that is, you're not alone because most people have never heard of it. It's this French pastry that's incredibly time consuming to make. So not a lot of people sell it, but it is uber uber delicious it's so good um so it's kind of like a sweetened croissant almost like an almond croissant so i'm gonna try to do this cheetah recipe we'll see if it works out uh some bananas as well um a couple boxes of pie crusts i i like these um they're super convenient i use these to make quiche and i bought a bunch of butter for the cheetah recipe for queen amman some cream cheese that's gonna go with the salmon uh, baguette and some capers I have in the fridge, some brown eggs, and a ton of cheese. My daughter's been really into cheese lately. So pepper jack, there's Swiss at the bottom there. We thought we would give these a try because they're, they're so cute, the Baby Bell cheeses. And this was on sale, I thought I would try it. It's a uh, type of goat brie. This will be during our French breakfast. Um, some fontina cheese, some sliced Swiss cheese. I'm gonna be using that along with the ham, along with croissants. My friend is bringing those. We're gonna have ham and cheese croissants. Some camembert that I will heat in the oven. And then a bunch of meats. So this is some chicken legs that I'll be using for us for a dinner during the week. And then a couple different sets of chicken breasts. At Kroger they had buy one get one free for the chicken breast so I think I'm gonna freeze one and then split one tray among two different dinners. All right so the meal plan for the week kind of depends on how things go with the get-togethers. If I have lots of leftovers we'll just eat those uh, the following days. So Sunday we're gonna have the mom's group brunch and we'll have the croissants with the ham and cheese. We'll also do the kale quinoa salad with some chickpeas. Oh, and I forgot, I have a watermelon sitting in my trunk that I need to get. We'll also be having the pink lemonade and uh, some quiche as well. Monday will be chicken adobo with the chicken legs and then on the side we'll have red skin potatoes roasted. Tuesday is a kale quinoa salad with chickpeas. It would be kind of nice to have that, especially since these previous days will be kind of heavy super fatty kinds of days. So it'd be nice to kind of have something light on Tuesday. Wednesday will be a chicken tortilla soup. I'm gonna take one of those chicken trays, boil the breasts, and then half of the meat will go into this tortilla soup. And then probably the other half I will freeze, just in case I need to make a soup for Friday or Saturday. 
Thursday is going to be cranberry tuna wraps. I'm going to continue to use those craisins that I got from Dollar Tree and I mix those in with some mayo, some celery, onion, tuna. It's really, really delicious actually. And then Friday is the game night with French breakfast. So the quiche, queen amand, smoked salmon, the baguette, fruit, cheese, which is the brie and the the other French cheese, uh, capers, possibly I will get out the French press for coffee, but it's at night, so I'm not sure people are gonna wanna do that. And then we'll have mimosas, which are probably not French, <laughs> I have no idea. But, you know, we will have some champagne, and that's French, so, you know. All right, so that is it for this grocery haul in meal plan. Let me know what you've been loving lately, and as always, thank you so much for watching, guys. Take care.